With just one week until Thanksgiving, a significant North Texas charity is still in need of traditional Thanksgiving foods. Jason Allen is live for us in Arlington. And Jason, Mission Arlington usually provides meals for thousands of people on Thanksgiving Day. It does, Ken. Almost 25,000 people last year, and they're thinking that they may do a few more this year. But then this is a year, of course, when you've heard about supply shortages and you've heard about inflation. And so in this year, they're not seeing some of those supplies come in at least quite as quickly as they have in years past. This is the 35th year for Mission Arlington, and they think that they're okay on turkeys to provide to families this year. It's the traditional items that they pack into those boxes, though. This is where they're short. They've put together about 3,000 thousand of those boxes and they've kind of come to a stop while they figure out what's going to go into the next few thousand boxes. When you think, well, we're out of stuffing, do you put a box of crackers or what do you do to substitute that? So we prefer to put Thanksgiving food in those Thanksgiving boxes. That makes sense. And so here's what Tilly Bergen said that they still need for those boxes. Uh, cans of carrots, broth, gravy, cranberry sauce, pie filling, sweet potatoes, and stuffing. And she told me they have faith it is going to get done before next week. As an example, she told me that they were running short on boxes this year. They were down to about a thousand of them. They made one phone call and they got a donation. So now they have enough boxes to last them probably the next 10 years. Ken, they're hoping and trusting that the same thing is going to happen with all of that food. Yeah. All right, Jason. Thank you very much. We appreciate it.